it may be cheaper, easier, and more precise to just buy bolts and things, but I still want to make my own. And so I went about modeling it. You know, you got to get that bolt looking shape. I had the shank of a size of 11 millimeters, so it would be 11. And then I went to cut out a ducktail from the, the bolt shape as well as cutting out a flat side on the bolt. So that way you could lay flat and be strong that way as well. I definitely had some problems with printing it. So for this first one here, we had some problems where it just wouldn't print the bottom part right or something. Anyways, it didn't print very well and the bottom suffered for that. And then I tried putting the next one in together and it was a little bit too big and so it snapped. And now I'm printing out another one. Hopefully this one will fit correctly and we won't have any problems. So I probably need to chamfer this so that it fits in here a lot better. It is a little weak along this line right here. That's the layer line, so it is probably going to break it this way. But we'll probably do some testing on another day. An M8 3D printed bolt. 